Hey, Perry here, Taylor Sound, tip of the day. Today, my tip is about two industry standard microphones. One is the Shure SM58, and the other is the Shure SM57. Now, these are ubiquitous in the live application, in live applications. And uh, so what, what are the differences? Um, one, this is probably meant uh, designed for live vocals. Now, you can use it for other things, but it's such a great microphone for live vocals. It's very focused sound, but it's very round. Uh, the, the top is very round, so you, you can get a lot of sound all the way around this head. Um, but it's, it's a great microphone for vocals, although I will say I've used it on guitar cabinets, even in the studio and live. I've used it on snare drums in a pinch uh, or toms, and it's a very versatile microphone. If you were to have one uh, microphone in the studio, this would probably be it. Um, the SM57, as you can see, the, the head is flat, and so it's meant to have the sound come directly into this uh, screen here, to push the sound directly. It's almost like, you know, a, a unidirectional uh, receiver. Um, you can get some sound around the side. There are famous uh, vocalists who use this uh, microphone uh, in live applications, Tom Petty being one of them. It does have kind of, uh, I guess, I wouldn't call it uh, brighter, thinner. Maybe that's a good term, but it's still a very good quality sound, even on a vocal. Um, it's a little bit awkward to to sing into just because it's so flat and small. This one just feels more comfortable when you're singing into it, so that's why most people choose this. But <clears throat> with this screen, it's meant to have sound coming into the screen. So when you mic up a guitar cabinet, you put it on the speaker, either pointing directly at the speaker or at a 45 degree angle, depending on kind of what sound you're going for or directly at a snare drum head or a tom head. Um, you, can, you can play with the angle a little bit, but just putting it directly uh, pointing towards the head or towards a cabinet is a really good place to start with this microphone in a live application and in the studio. These are really great versatile microphones for that. So in essence, this is great for live vocals and in a pinch, you can use it almost as if you would use an SM57 on snares, cabinets, toms, that kind of a thing. But this is a great microphone for um, cabinets, snares, toms, but you can also use this in a pinch on a live vocal, and many vocalists do. So that is a comparison of these two industry standard mics. Hope that helps. Rock on.